Well, hello there, Shiller Rocks here. Welcome to the Spectrum Retreat. We've just started a new game. This is a new challenging first person uh, puzzle game set in the near future. And it's uh, you awake in the uh, Penrose Hotel, a peaceful yet unsettling refuge from the outside world. So, this is published by Ripstone and it's by um, a developer called Dan Smith. So, here we go. Okay, so we're in our nice little cozy. Uh, Hotel here. I guess I should really answer the door. I want to have a little look round first, though. What's all this stuff? Hmm. Looks like I'm on my own. What is that? Splendid. Okay. Don't see anything suspicious. Can we uh, go in the toilet? No. Let's open the door. Ah. Okay. Good I hope you had a restful sleep, and I do apologize for the disturbance. Hopefully you recall requesting this wake-up call. Uh, while we no, I don't recall that at all. So who are you? So this you is this a robot or something? Touch. Breakfast what is being is served it? in our restaurant downstairs. I'll let the host know you're on your way. Uh, and please, enjoy your stay. Okay, so it looks like I'm staying in this hotel. Is that my phone? It's got to be in the pocket of my coat here. No? Where is it? Oh, there it is, over here. There we go. Is that a phone? Do I have to press the button? Syncing audio interface. Complete. Um. Are we not going to answer the phone? Did, did we answer the phone then? Right, can I leave this place then? Right, we can open the door now. I don't know what that phone call was all about. Okay, here we go. Right, so. Check messages. You are expected. Downstairs. Okay, so this way we've got reception, restaurant, library, and ballroom, and the pool. Okay. We can't interact on these doors. Let's have a little look at this hotel then, so... It looks okay at the moment, but I'm pretty sure the Shining Hotel looked okay at the start. Good morning. My apologies. The elevator will be back up and running soon. Why not enjoy some breakfast while you wait? Um, where? Where's the breakfast? What's all this as well? This, I can't quite zoom in. This is everything like robots in this hotel. Let's, let's go the complete opposite way. You meant, you meant to go the other way, so let's go this way. Now that's interesting. These paintings here... Oh, no, 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 it's the same. Look, I don't think you'll be able to make it on the final uh, upload of this, but these paintings look like really sort of like old and scratchy uh, effects. Looks pretty nice, like um, watercolours. Ooh, now why is this... Wait a minute, is that my room? Have I just done a th 360? <laughs> yeah, that's the room I've just come from. Okay. Let's go back to... Oh, we need to go up here and go down then. Let's go this way. How on earth we ended up back here again? Oh, I'm just curious about these paintings. So it looks like it's an entertainment type hotel. Seems to be lots of pictures showing you around the hotel. Like microphones, like there's entertainments and stuff like that. A Dan Smith game. I've not played a game like this for years that just shows you all the intros you play the game. That's pretty awesome. The Spectrum Retreat. Okay, I've not seen a single Spectrum computer yet. I'm hoping that comes on in a bit. Not got a clue what the name means. I don't know if it's Spectrum as in a colour. Or it means something else. It looks like... Now, the thing that's got me... That's got me... Got me brain tingling so far is... This hotel appears to be... Run by, like, androids or robots. So, what am I? Am I a robot? Am I a robot on holiday? So what is this? Penrose. 
unequaled marvels, astonishing entertainment, braving the horrendous weather, and the most arduous of treks to be at the Penrose for one night only at the specific request of the management, offering magnificent conjuring. The great Splendisi, the man who knows, casting spells and reading minds, predicting fortunes, swallowing sword and fire, and that's not all. For his finale, he will be encased with water and will free himself from his chains. We humbly urge you to take note of this. You will never forget the Olympian entertainment he provides in the big show, the grandest night of the season, the ballroom of the Penrose. That sounds pretty good. Right, so I need to go for breakfast. I can see something glowing over there, but let's go and talk to this receptionist. Now there's someone who knows how good our famous breakfasts are. Sorry to report the weather has taken a okay. turn for the worst, but don't let that spoil your appetite. Please, I won't. Make yourself comfortable in the restaurant. Okay. Let's go to the restaurant now. Let's ignore the rest of these losers. I, I take it's over there. I want to see what this is though. What's glowing? Scan log. Employee 237, entry 1. I've got my dream job. Didn't think it was possible. Here I am. I didn't even have to go through most of the process. Someone with serious sway must, must have liked my portfolio. I start for real tomorrow. Hopefully I can make a good impression. This is Cameron Worrell, Spectrum Experience Designer. Okay. Interesting. Morning. Hope you enjoy your stay. No, she she sounds like a ray of sunshine. What about this one? I hear breakfast is especially good this morning. Okay. I bet the breakfast is going to be awful. It's going to be cocoa Very pops. Good morning. Okay. Okay. Will. Free. What? Will free you at normal. What in Carmen San Diego is going on? Okay, what? I'm opening my honey nut clusters around here. Good morning. Your reserved table is ready when you are, and please mind your step. Seems one of our guests left in something of a hurry. Um. Okay. So where's the actual? Restauranty bit. Is that my table, the red one that no one else is sitting at that looks really sticking out like a sore thumb? Reserved? Yes. I want to see my hands. Right. What are these phones? Where what do these phones keep coming from? Good. Attempting contact. <laughs> what on earth? Uh, the time zooming around. The food's gone. We appear to have accelerated time somehow. This is a little bit spooky. Can we, can we sneak out around the back? Where all good stuff is. There's nothing really in it here. It's a, re it's a really shiny kitchen. Ooh. Hello? Cooper. Hello. Hello. If you can hear this, hide your phone now. Now, hide your phone right now. How do I hide it? Don't let the staff know you have this phone. My name's Cooper. I believe okay. you're being held here against your will. I'm going to try to help you, but you must do everything I say. Okay. I'm going to send an update to your phone. This will let you receive calls from me automatically. So you can just focus on trying to act naturally. Sorry about... Oh, shit. Shit, the signal's being blocked. Uh, just... Oh, hold on, I can fix this. Oh, what's going on? Did you see that then? That was like... <laughs> that was a bit freaky. So, they did mention before about the weather's turn, so I'm assuming I can't get outside. Okay, if you can hear me, make your way to the elevator. Yep, <laughs> straight back in. Right, the elevator. I think I saw the elevator. Uh, it was upstairs. Okay. Let's go back upstairs. This thing says we're connected. So what is it to do in this, in this the hotel elevator, then? Get I'll know you can hear me. Okay. I'm going to get to the elevator and I know you can hear me. Right. Ballroom pool. of elevators this way. I can't run though, so it is quite a nice slow paced uh, game so far. Very mysterious though. What is going on? 
get to the elevator, then I'll know you can hear me. How fast do you think I can walk? Seriously. I need to find the elevator. I don't think I came this way before. Ooh. Why has that got a keypad? Ooh. Interesting. This thing says we're connected. Get to the elevator, then I'll know you can hear me. Okay, we'll try the other way then. It's got to be one of these ways. Just say, oh yeah, the elevator is this way. This is what, oh, this was before it was under. Here we go. Good. If you're at the elevator, then the tracker and the phone is working. Let's call the elevator. And with any luck, the elevator should be working again too. Okay, here we go. Elevator's coming. You never know, this might be easier than I thought. That's it, you're nearly there. All you have to do is get to the roof. Give it a go. Okay, let's go to the roof. Oh, bollocks. It's not working. That means I couldn't upload the credentials you need. Uh, You're going to have to hack the system from within and... How am I going to do that? Everything you see, everything you hear is going to sound crazy, but, well, hopefully okay. not everything. We have to put things right, and that starts with you. Your mind, it's fragile and complicated so got no feet I've got no feet we have to do this one step at a time i have to let you remember at your own pace okay i promise i'll do whatever it takes to get you out of here i swear it hmm yeah. somewhere nearby there should be a door that doesn't match the others that was the one the past let me know when you found it that was I'll the one back. that was the one from before wasn't it it's got to be it's on the keypad Let's go that was back down this way. And it was right at the end. Down here. Yeah, it's gotta be this one. Ah, oh, from the readings I'm seeing here, looks like you found it. Okay. Uh, through that door is an access point What's leading the code, to an though? authentication challenge. It's, oh, it's hard to explain, but this is how our QA technicians could get out if anything went wrong. Okay. Usually. Oh, I'm getting what's, ahead of myself. What's the number then? Uh, the last code I had for this door was 1782. See if it works. 1782. Nope. Crap. Wrong. All the access points have been reconfigured too. We're going to have to do this manually. Okay. Okay. In Give me another code. Of our early Give me a code. Got locked in, keys, well, clues were oh. left to help them get into these access points. Okay. This whole place is about conformity. Everything's designed to provide a uniform experience. So what you have to do is find anything that stands out that l looks different, but mm. not so much that the staff here would remove it. Um, I guess that means I've got to wander around and see, try and see stuff that's a little bit different then. Uh, look out for something, anything different uh, that stands out, but that could be hidden in plain sight. Um, so I guess I'm looking for like random objects. Hmm, I hope it gives me a clue because I've not seen anything like that at all. And is it on this floor? I don't think it's going to be around here. Let's have a little look. I can't find the answer here. The documentation's no help. Um, if I'm remembering rightly, nothing on that. Something to do with the doors? Uh, something the other doors don't have. Okay, let's go and look at the doors then. We will inspect some doors. And what was this way? Ballroom and pool. Can we go this way yet? Nope. That's for later on. I reckon it's, it's not going to be around here. That's all pretty locked off. Right, so let's take a little look at the doors. The doors... They've got the three symbol on them. They've got mm, that symbol and that symbol. So we'll try and see if we can see a door that looks slightly different than that. <laughs> That's my best hunch at the moment. Also, I'm also scanning for items that I can interact with. Maybe that'll give away a clue. Now, those doors to me look pretty much identical. So, don't think it's there. There's all these luggage things left everywhere as well. Um, anything here? 
There's a phone there, but I cannot use it. Okay. That door looks the same. We've all got the three. Wait a minute. So these have got numbers on these doors. The other ones didn't. 115, 114, 116, 104. What the heck? These door numbers don't make any sense. Uh, 106, 107, 108. So here's my room. I don't think the clue is going to be in my room though, is it? We'll have another little scout around here, see if we can spot anything we might have missed the first time. Oh, right. What can I write? Okay. Is that how many days I've been here? Okay, so my rooms are bust. There's literally nothing in here. What's this, this book here with the symbols on? I don't know what that means. Hmm. Um, now, did I come this way? I think I, I think I need to go this way. So that's 110. 111. Yeah, these doors are all the same to me. And we've already scanned all those doors. Let's go back this way. Should we go and examine these ones? 124. 125. There's not that many doors around here, though. No, that's, that's the main entrance. Wow, this is a lot harder <laughs> than I thought. She's not giving me any clues, though. And I literally can't interact with these. Seen this symbol a lot. That symbol was in my room. Uh, one, two, six. And yeah, these doors look like they match. These doors don't have numbers on there, or do they? No, they do. Look, one, two, eight. Um, what's that? One thirty. I thought it was like a book or something. Yeah, it's just all various uh, pictures of the, the hotel. Oh, hang on. This has got, look, this has got a symbol on the door. 1313. Ah, okay. What do you reckon? Here we go. 1313. That took me far too Please long to figure out. <laughs> I've still got a shot at this. Okay. Ahead of you. There's a lift. Another door will lead to the authentication challenge, which you have to complete on your own. Okay. You won't be able to reach you inside. The device you have, it's not just a phone, it's... Look, this is hard to explain quickly. Um, you'll be able to absorb and exchange certain colours. Um, what? I don't know how that must sound. It sounds like you're a bit mental, love. It should make sense when you're in there. Good luck. Okay. This sounds weird. Authentication challenge. Colour swap module installed. Okay, so... Exchange colours. Transfer complete. Okay, so... I'm sucking the colour into this. And then I've gone pat... What? I really don't understand what I'm doing. It's letting me pass that, though. Okay, so I can't get past that when it's like that. But I can interact with that. Hopefully get through that. Now, is this... That's, that's blocked me, right? So if I interact with that again... Nice. I'm just switching the colours around. There we go. Let's switch it around again. Through we go. Switch this one out. 
Oh, you're giving me two to go through now. Ooh, three, in fact. That's got a hole for the window, so let's let's do that one. Okay. Do that one. Look through the... Oh, we can't. Access blocked. Hmm. Uh, can we... Can we suck it through there? All right, let's try this again. Let's... Oh, we can't interact with that one again. Let's give the colour back to the... No, let's try this one. Let's try that one. And then that one. Okay. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> I've luckily done it. Don't have a clue how I did it, but just copy what I did. Okay, 101 complete. So I'm guessing that's level one puzzle one. Okay, another authentication challenge. Ah, these are going to start getting more and more complicated. So, it looks like we've got three different ones there, and there's a look a looksy hole there. So, I can't activate that one. I can go through here, though, and do these. Hmm, why would I want to swap it like that? I don't think that was right, was it? Blocked. Oh, hang on a minute. Do I need to fill these up with this other colour? So that one's blocked again. Let's go back over here. So if I suck the red out of that one, that locks that one. If I go through here like that, I can suck it out of there now like that. Fill that up, so that's two done. Okay, I think I need to get this last. Oh, there's not another red one there, though, is there? I can't, I can't. So, th basically, this thing I've got is like a colour swapper. So, I must need to figure out to do these in a certain order. So, uh, there is a thing behind there, if you look. Let's try and put that one in there. Okay, now, if I do it like that now is it is it when it's red I can get through it it is isn't it so I think I need to do the colors over here some somehow I'm missing one color so we'll put that back there that on that one we'll go and grab that color now that's also locked yeah so that opens... Wait a minute, that doesn't open that one. That's interesting. That opens that one, though. I think you need to suck the colour out to get in here. There we go. No, there's only, there's only the two colours in here. There's nothing else really in this room. So that's got to be right. But I need to do it in there like that and suck it out. Maybe I just need to do these in a certain order, so let's try and do first and second. Okay, that door's locked. Can we do anything with this one over here? Let's try and do them both like that. So that's the two back ones. Defeated by that door. Hmm. I'm pretty sure we've tried this one. Right, I must, be, I must be doing something really stupid. I don't see why it doesn't open that one. Now, if we suck it in there like that, though... Ah! I know what I need to do. Right, so my theory behind this is you suck the colours, you swap them. So, if that is like that and I can't get through... I need to put the colour in. So I can open that one there, suck this colour back up, get to the next bit, fill that bit up, get to the next bit, suck it out and open that bit. Yes, there we go. I don't know if I need to take more colours with me or not. There's a couple of doors over here. Um, now, interestingly, if I can't use any of that, but 
there's this window here, so let's dump my colour off there and try and suck the colour up here. Now, is that going to open all of these up for me? Nope, only one. But now I can switch it over again. Suck it up again. Oh, yeah. Don't know how enough did that. <laughs> we did that one. Okay, that's 102 done. So this is cool. This is quite mysterious. It does make it does make you want to get through to the ends of the puzzles to see what's at the end. Oh, um, um. Right. So. Oh no no no! That's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. Is it? Wait a minute. When can we walk on it then? No, I'm just gonna keep falling. How do I uh, get the colour at the end? Oh, there we go. You can do it from a distance. Of course. Of course you can. Okay, so when it's when it's got like symbols like that on it, it's it's solid. Nice. Uh, I do want to fall down there. Yes, I do. Now, do I want to swap that? I guess so. And then kind of suck it back out again and go through here. And Bob's your uncle and Aunt Giovanni. We've done it. So that's three puzzles we've done now. Now I can go through there. And there. I think I can walk on that one. Yes. So I guess I've got to suck that one out. We can still walk on... No, we can't walk on that. Okay. Note to self, do not do that that way around again. Right, so we'll come over here again. We'll suck that up. And we'll... F <laughs> I've defeated the system. I fell down here. Can we? Can we do this in a cheaty way then? Because I'm quite clearly not meant to be down there on this bit. Yeah, I think I think I've I think I've just broken I think I've just broken the game. Um, am I literally stuck on this bit? Wow, that's uh, good to see. All these years of being a QA tester has uh, paid off. I've actually broken the game. I'm actually recording. But anyway, so I'm gonna leave that there for now because it's, it's coming up to half an hour mark. So this is um game called the spectrum retreat so what more are we going to unlock in this i'm going to um going to save this uh, and quit it uh let me know if you want to see some more of the puzzles on this it does seem to be quite an interesting mix of puzzles on the game so yeah really fun game so far anyway if you want to see more don't forget to comment below and let me know that you do want to see more that's it for now i'm shirley rocks this is the spectrum warrior see you next time